emancipate yourself from mental slavery. None but ourselves can free our minds. Have no fear for atomic energy. Cause none of them can stop but it time. Oh, won't you help to sing these songs of freedom? Cause all I ever had redemption songs. Hey, peace and blessings, rays of light. How are you today? I am Oya, and welcome to The Oya Show. If you're tuning in, I know you are ready to shine like the star you are. Okay. I want to talk about the very force that drives the message to these videos and why I do them. The power of positivity. Your mind is amazing, and your ability to have powerful thoughts is part of what makes us such a miracle. Henry Ford said something that always sticks with me. Whether you think you can or think you can't, you're right. Those words truly sum up how much your thoughts can affect your life. What we let grow in our minds can create either healthy thoughts are unhealthy thoughts. Our mind can support us and help us move towards joy or it can hold us back. Your mind can send you happy, supportive vibes that can push you through times <laughs> or they can keep you stuck in a rut. So let me ask you, is your mind sending you good vibrations? are negative messages. Do you tell yourself, I'm incredible and worthy? Or are you more likely to think, I'm a bad person and I don't deserve success and happiness? When stuff gets tough, do you fight to get through it or just give up? If you're not sure, Let's try a little experiment with your mind. I bet you'll be surprised by what you find knocking on in there. <laughs> so think about a goal you have for your life. It can be short term or it can be long term. Now, think about that goal from two angles. Here's the first angle. I want you to think, ah, oh, I can never do that. That's too hard. It will never happen. Okay. What happened when you thought that? Come on. I know you've thought that before. How did that make you feel in that moment or right now when you are thinking about something you want to do and you're just like, that just can't happen. It doesn't feel great, huh? Okay. How about turning it around? Think about that same goal. Then think about all of your talents, your gifts, and all you can offer to this world as the person who is uniquely you. Think about that goal and say, yes. Yes, I can do it. Say it again. Yes, I can do this. Okay, so how do you feel now? Hmm? You're, you're probably pretty pretty good right now. You're probably feeling pretty great, huh? Because see, here's a little something that you can think about that as long as you're responsible for your own thoughts, you're in charge. So do you tell yourself you're not good enough? Well, then I'm here to tell you it's time to make you turn around. Yeah, make a U-turn, run in the other direction and never look back. Because so many people don't understand the implications of how and what they are thinking. When they dive into their minds, <laughs> they are stunned by all the negative thoughts and judgments. That negative self-talk will have an effect on everything you do 
and it's a lie. Yes, it's actually a lie. Even if someone else feeds you negativity, you can't believe it. Let it just go right through you. And you know why? Because you are solely responsible for what you believe about yourself. All those nasty opinions from the peanut gallery are not welcome in your mind. You hear me? It's not welcome. We can all visualize a new reality with our minds by using positive intentions, positive intentions and affirmations. These tools will ground our dreams. Oh man, I've seen so many people, even those who thought that their dreams seemed kind of silly at first, who made them come true just by believing the best about themselves. And they came true. They made them come true. You still don't believe me? Okay. Well, let me tell you about um, just some of the ways that your mind can change when you start accentuating the positive. <laughs> you learn to respect yourself and others more. Your judgment about what others think about you and what you think about yourself will disappear because you'll be focusing on yourself and how to put out positive energy. When you rise above all those nasty low vibrations, you will also find solutions instead of complaining, complaining, complaining about problems that you just can't solve. So start being action instead of all talk. Don't talk about it. You know, be about it. Take the action. See clear action steps that can contribute to your own success and even the success of those you love. Release your fears so you can use your mind as a way to manifest everything you want in your life. <laughs> okay, so now your weekly star point. Accentuate the positive. Yes, like my song. You got to accentuate the positive. I mean, when you start feeling that negativity creep into your mind, whip yourself back into shape. And now, your star action? Say, I can. Say it loud. Say it proud. Say it right now. I can. I can. Let me hear you. I can. Are you saying it? Now, this is, this is one little thing that can be tough. I know. But say something specific that you can do this week out loud. Take the time to believe in yourself and stay positive. Scream from the rooftops that I can do it. And guess what? You will. Even if it takes just a little bit of time over the day days, the weeks, keep doing it because you will believe and you will start to take action steps once you shift that mindset. And as you're shifting that mindset and as you get into the positive flow, I want to hear from you. So please comment, like, and share, share, share to help others think positive, to manifest their dreams and live their life purpose, those ones that you love. And in the meantime, as I always say, don't let anyone or anything dim your light. Go out and shine like the star you are. Peace and blessings. I'm Moya.